Last year, Hananiga Wrestling missed a conference championship by just 10 and a half points, falling to the Belvedere Co-op as they won the conference for the second straight year. They were looking for a different result this time around at their home gym. But first, we will start with some finishers from the early weight classes and work our way up at 106 and 113. It's the Cassiope Twins, Rocco taking 106 and Bruno right above him for a win there. And at the 120 weight class, the ERAP Jose Young brings his East team a first place finish. And at 126, Bryson Tennyson takes first for the Belvedere Co-op. And getting to some of the highlights now, we will start with a nice reversal from East Donald Cannon. He won the 132 weight class, a nice move there. And at 138, Hananiga's Thomas Silva with a thundering takedown there. He would beat Belvedere to win the class at 144. Two of the top teams going head-to-head, -head. Dana Wixon getting the sprawl and the takedown for a dominant win for the E-Rabs. Hano repping at 150 as well after the ERAB silences the crowd there. Max Haskins going up against Belvedere. Nice double leg takedown there. Grabs another win for Hano in their home gym. At 157, it's the top two teams again. East and Hano. Check out this move from Brody Sendelli. Getting the cradle and the pin to grab another Indians win. And they are running away with it now. You can see a pattern here. Same two schools at 165. Connor Diemel shaking his own gym with a thundering takedown. Grabs another win over East. Takes the 165 class and at 175. After nearly missing first last year, their squad not messing around. Curtis Smith grabs the win there. Different matchup at 190, Carlando Dubois grabs a big win over Harlem. The Jayhawk fired up with that win. Two classes remaining now, another Hano wrestler and another Smith. This time, Isaac Smith gets the double leg takedown, grabs a win over Belvedere. And to close things out at 285, East first Freeport, the e rabs big fullback, Lee Smith, showing what he can do on the mat, gets the takedown and ends the final match of the day with a pin. Congrats to Smith on that win. And now let's check out the team scores from the day. Ananiga runs away with it, winning the championship by 91 points, tying a conference record with eight Nick 10 individual champs today. East had a great showing as well, finishing in second with a score of 170. The pretzels round out the top three, scoring 131. We'll have additional coverage of the matches on our website, WREX.com. That'll be coming out later tonight.